A top focus we are on at this hour. The spotlight is back on the Indo-Pacific region as China prepares to add more military might to its navy. The Asian superpower is expected to launch two multi-role naval warships, adding muscle to its new generation of aircraft carrier strike groups. According to the reports, China plans to launch two frigates by the end of this year. Aside from the one under construction in Guangzhou, another one is being built at a shipbuilding in Shanghai. The People's Liberation Army plans to build at least four aircraft carrier strike groups by 2030. This will make it the world's second biggest modern blue water navy after the United States of America. The revelation comes in the light of the escalating concerns over China's aggressive military expansion in the Indo-Pacific region. The latest to comment on the feared regional instability is New Zealand's Prime Minister Chris Hipkins. In a speech, Hipkins referred to the Pacific region becoming more contested, less predictable and less secure. This after the Kiwi leader led a trade mission to China last month and expressed interest in boosting the economic ties with the country. In response to the comments made by Hipkins, the Chinese government has expressed a willingness to have a dialogue with the New Zealand leader. Take a listen. Uh, Meanwhile, Taiwan has reported a record number of Chinese warships in waters around the island. According to the Defense Ministry of Taiwan, a record 16 warships were spotted in just a 24-hour period last week. The incident on Saturday comes days after dozens of Chinese warplanes were reported to fly past the median line of the Taiwan Strait and also into the key regions of Taiwan's air defense identification zone.